Hello everybody. Welcome back to my Learn Scratch channel. And today I'm going to show you how to make a bouncing ball on Scratch. But this time it's going to like go to the ground and then it's going to change its shape and then bounce back up and then it's going to change its shape. I mean, sorry about that mail because um, from my Scratch friends, I usually get messages, which um, I that's why I have so many followers. Okay, um, if you want, you can check out my um, previous project where um, we made this thing. So we made this wrecking game, because you can see, just wrecks, wrecks, and it also plays some music, but since my volume is down, let me um, take it up a little bit, I think. Okay, I think that's good. Oh yeah, there, it just plays music and then it wrecks. So um, yeah, in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make a different bouncing ball. So um, don't forget, all of you, don't forget to check out all my other videos if you, have, or if you are new to my channel. And um, a little bit about me is that I ride um, a, like a big bike, like a pink, um, my size bike because my other bike was um, too small for me, so I got a new bike. So uh, that's my bike story, and uh, I only had two days to finish riding my bike, and I knew exactly how to ride my bike across the road. Now, um, let's just get to the scratch thing. Okay, so um, I will be right back after the intro plays. So don't forget to do all that stuff at the end if I tell anything. So please remember to check out all my other videos if you're new to my channel. And I will be seeing you very soon after the intro. Okay, guys, so we are back on the screen right after I showed my intro. So um, I can't believe I had nine subscribers and I also have like, wait. Yeah, I have 230 views. I Oh my gosh, I don't know how I have 230 views because this is so amazing. I don't know how I have that many views on my channel. Okay, let's just go ahead and get to Scratch. So first, um, if you haven't, if you are new to Scratch, and if you haven't watched my videos, please create an account and start creating your own projects by watching my videos. If you don't have to watch my videos, you can see the all the other tutorials on YouTube. Like, but I'm not really sure what you will create. So I can't wait to see all your projects if you send them on my profile because almost everyone's commenting on my profile. Okay, so um, now let's go ahead and click create. If you don't know what that is, just click that create button and then you're gonna come to this page, Untitled 3. Well, you just X out the cat sprite and try, instead of um, going just directly clicking on the, sprite button you go hover over the sprite button and choose paint now you're going to come to this screen which we're going to be making the ball so um how to make this ball is we're going to make a uh, grass so we're going to make that and now we're going to make the ball so um ball is supposed to be bouncing in the costumes and so we're going to go ahead and make the ball so the ball must be coming down so we can make it any color except uh, we we want you to see it. So um, I'm going to make it, going to make it there. Okay, now we have a ball. So this ball is going to be bouncing up and down and it's going to be going like that. So now we're going to duplicate the costume and um, drag your mouse a little bit down. 
And drag your mouse a little bit down. Whoa, whoa, wait. Okay, I'm gonna just make these costumes since this video might be too long because I'm gonna be making the costumes. It might take some time to make these costumes. So take your time if you, um, haven't finished a step or if you're still working on something, please pause the video and um, and you can finish whatever you're doing and then you can continue with my tutorial. So please pause the video if you have not done a step, you know, like if you have not finished a step, you can just um, pause the video because I can't do anything about it, but um, YouTube can, so please, um, do that. Okay, guys, actually, well, while I was talking, I already made the sprite. So when it hits the ground, it will make a sound. So, um, so, um, like right now, we're gonna search for a sound ball basketball. Yeah, like that. That's kind of good because now we'll drag out a one green five clicked and then drag out forever loop since we're going to do that. Next costume. One green five clicked. Costume number. Costume number equals um costume name. Oh wait, costume. Name equals costume nine. I'm gonna just do this. If you um don't know how to do this, please check out on other things or stuff. Um, but I will be finishing this um thing, okay? Like I will be almost done by um doing this. So um, please uh forward the video if you don't want to see what I'm doing. Well, okay, wait. Okay, and now, as you can see, um, it's just bouncing and then it's going up. I don't know why it's doing that. Well, that is because we haven't added more costumes. So um, I'm gonna add more costumes. Okay, okie dokie, choky. We have our costumes already. Now we just need to put them down and um, they are going to be bouncing. So as you can see, I am just um, making them like that. So the costume is going to be here, and this costume is going to be okay. There we go. Wait, you don't have to do that. Okay. So there is our whole bouncing ball. It's just bouncing and then going back up. It's bouncing and going back up. You can um, also do different ways. I'm not really sure what you'll do because um, I'm not rushing your project right now because I'm making the video. So this is how you make a ball bouncing game. As you can see, it was just bouncing. We can also do some changes by creating a backdrop. For example, I will make a light blue backdrop like this. And now as you can see, the ball will be bouncing. So you can uh, do some things like uh, put the grass, what if you wanna put the grass as another sprite, you can put and paint another sprite, or maybe you can uh, do it like some um, animation. Like for example, you wanted to put two black lines here to make the ball looking like it's bouncing. Or maybe you can change the color of the ball. I'm not really sure what you'll do because, um, once again, I am what doing this video. You're um you're just watching, and I can't wait to see. 
So as you can see, here is how the product turned out. It's just bouncing and going back up. You can also do the thing that I was trying to do, but I, that one might make the video too long. So as you can see, that is how you make the ball bouncing game. You can change the position if um, you want to do any changes. You can just go to that position, point in that direction, and then show it. And then um, you can do that stuff because um, the ball might be, what if you drag it somewhere else, for example, and now, yeah, you can't see the ball. Well, it just goes back to that position. What if I change the direction to 55? Now it's like, eh. So what do you do now? Well, we'll just click the flag and then it goes back to normal. Boom. Okay, um, how I made it bounce because I just um, found that sound and then I put it here and the costume name of was costume nine because costume nine is when the ball hits the ground. When the, the, so when the ball hits the ground, then it plays the bouncing sound. You can make it a basketball or whatever ball you'd like. You can even choose the scratch balls, for example, if you want to choose a ball and then it could be bouncing or you can just make your own ball like I did and um, do your animation. So yeah, that is how you make a bouncing ball animation and scratch. I hope you enjoyed this simple tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And also don't forget to hit the notification bell if you want to see more Learn Scratch videos. I can't wait to see you next time. Bye guys.